<laughs> How, tell us about the difficulties about change your accent, you know, with the Irish accent. Uh, well, it, it, it was takes, fun? It takes work. Yeah, it's fun, though. Uh, once you find the melody and mm -hmm. make a song out of it, I think. But, yeah, it takes work. Not my strong point. <laughs> And well, for us, for the audience, you are classified as, well, as a sex symbol, as uh, the greatest mm -hmm. actor of your generation and everything. And for ah, you. Easy now. <laughs> <laughs> Careful. Careful. <laughs> and for you, who's Brad Pitt? Uh, who's Brad Pitt for yourself? Shoot, I, w I wouldn't know how to define that. Uh, just, just me, the guy you, uh, you wake up with, I think. Mm -hmm. And what's the meaning of beauty for you? for to be a sex symbol, do you think? Oh, I had to bounce her off. <laughs> Tell us about the experience working on this e devil song, you know, I mean, your mm. your relationship with Harrison Ford. Yeah. How was it? Oh, it's good. I've always, Harrison's always been one of my favorites because uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, he's just such a man of integrity and, and I love his common sense on the screen. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, I've always watched that and learned from it. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and the, the toughest thing to do, I think, is to make things seem every day. And he's, he's the best at it. It's best. Mm -hmm. Tell us about those odd jobs you used to do before you became a famous actor. Oh, well, it's like everyone. I mean, you do what you can to put food on the table, so you pay your rent. Mm -hmm. uh, and just everything. Deliver refrigerators to kids. Uh, uh, I think dressed up as a chicken for a fast food joint, I, th I think that's the one they always print. Uh, drove strippers around. I did, you know, whatever <laughs> I could, whatever I could. Did it make you think in a life in a different way? Huh? It, I mean, ha made those jobs make you feel in a life in a different way. Like you have to try hard to to get what you want. Well, sure, you have to. Uh, you can learn anything, but you you have to work at it and. Uh, mm. Uh, that's all. Mm -hmm. Just know it's work, and and also appreciate the people who uh, who are you. still doing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. You have been classified as a sex symbol. I'm and sorry. Yes. No. No. Not drink it. And also, I mean, no, you're I mean trying <laughs> hard to be trying your hard. I mean, to prove to prove that you are a great actor too. Is it difficult for you, like dealing with? You well, know the, the difference is not trying to prove anything because mm -hmm. uh, and you make decisions for the wrong reasons. And uh, I, I enjoy acting, and uh, I just want to find the part that uh, each time that that I can relate to at the time. And and, and you learn something and you take something away from every film. So that's more what it's about for me. Mm -hmm. And all, from all your characters you have portrayed, which is more like Brad Pitt. Ah, well, they're all little bits yes, of yourself. Yes, even sure. the psycho in California. <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid so, <laughs> without the knives. <laughs> which one is more like, I mean, when, with which one do you feel more um, identified? I see, I'm, I would say all of them and none of them. None of them? Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. What's the meaning of love for you? Uh, I mean, I know it's an abstract term, you know, but I wanted to tell us what's the meaning of love for you. What's the meaning of love? Mm -hmm. Well, again, be my girl, but uh, I, I just have great respect for it. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, just think it's the greatest compliment in the world to mm -hmm. ask someone to spend the rest of your life with you, and, mm -hmm. and for her to accept. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Finally, <coughs> which movie do you think is going to win on the Oscar awards? Um, I, I don't know yet. I have still a couple of films I need to see. And uh -huh. And who knows? Who knows? Yes. I mean, it, it's a crapshoot, but uh, there's some great, great performances of this year. Thanks a lot. Okay. <laughs>